Hi, my name is Carsten Fyn Nielsen, and I'm from Aalborg University Mobile Device Group. I would like to present to you this implementation of network coding on the MEMO platform, more specifically the Nokia N810. This implementation is based on COPE using XOR coding. We've also made an implementation using random linear coding on the Series 60 platform. This specific testbed consists of 16 devices. We also have plans to make one containing 50. At this point, we would like to thank Nokia for the provided devices in the past and hopefully in the future. In the scenario here, each of the 16 nodes have part of a data set and they all need the full data set. To distribute the data, they would normally use broadcast in wireless LAN. This would result in a lot of collisions and to avoid this, we are investigating what would happen if we used network coding instead. This should hopefully increase throughput and decrease energy consumption. Now we will demonstrate broadcast. The red color on the devices indicate a missing packet and the green color indicates a packet the device have. Next up is network coding. Again, the green and red color means the same, but if you see a blue number, this indicates how heavily coded this transmission was. The result of our investigation is that a network coding approach can improve throughput and will decrease energy consumption. And therefore, that network coding is a good approach on mobile devices such as these. Now we would like to thank Ben Croyer from the technical department and we would like to thank Nokia. And finally, thank you for listening. <laughs>